I'm just like, okay, my sister don't like you. Like, I'm like, okay. we fighting at this point. Right. We're gonna fight. You bring your brothers. She's talking about she got her sisters and her cousins. You know, we What's up, working gang? We're back with another YouTube, YouTube video. video. Today's video is going to actually be a story time. McBain. I really don't know what you would call this story. It's really juicy. It's really, it's juicy, but it's a mess. Like, it's really a mess. Yeah. We got pizza, so we're gonna try to eat or whatever. All right. Y'all know we don't really eat that much anyway, so. Right. We're gonna say it goes. So, don't think we waste the food because we're gonna eat it after. We're gonna eat it after. We just already ate. Somebody ate it after. Right. Right. Somebody ate. So we have um, buffalo chicken pizza right here, and then we have. When I first opened up, I said, "What is that?" Because Soleil had ordered it. So then we have chicken that. Alfredo right here, and then we have these bread sticks. These bread sticks. Where's the mozzarella to them? Right. They're Anyways, like so basically, this story takes place in sixth grade, and if y'all don't know, sixth grade was our most hectic year. Like, right. It was our most. I feel like it was the funnest year for me because yeah, because it was like we was doing a lot, like right. not really like we wasn't Instagram famous. I'm talking we about in, in the school. school, like right. we ran in school. We was always getting it was in trouble. It was always fun. something, but yeah. it was so fun. It takes place in sixth grade. I think the middle slash towards the end yeah, of the school year. year. Yeah. Um. So let's just get right to it. We're not gonna hope y'all. We just gonna get right, right. to it. Around y'all know me in sixth grade, I was real shy, like real, real shy. Yanni was really so shy. They had, we had a group of friends, but so let's talk to them more. I was just kind of like a bandwagon or whatever. So you know, I had made my own friend. We're gonna call her Trophy. So I had made my own friend. Her name was Trophy. Me and her was good friends. Me. This really Yanni's story at yeah. first. Then it's then I, it's I got story. myself in the mix, and then the flipped, and now it's just a lot. We just want y'all to know a key information, key point of information. Mm -hmm. So. Trophy's sister used to work at the gym that we used to do boxing and just sit to it. So, right. but we didn't know that at the time. So just keep that in mind. So me and Trophy become friends or whatever. Um, mind you, Trophy like a little tomboy. I could tell she like girls or whatever. So me, I wasn't. I was in sixth grade. I wasn't really worried about all of that. Like right. I was just, you know, I had a friend. I had a friend that I could talk to. Like you know, we just thought we were so grown in sixth grade. Yo, so I had a little friend that I could talk to. Whatever. So me and her friends or whatever. You know. My our lockers are not near each other, so she would come to my locker and walk me to my classes and everything, and then go down to her classes, and you know we just meet up every day and just talk to each other. So it had got kind of weird because, you know, like I said, I wasn't really worried about none of that. So it had got kind of weird because she would carry my books and bring me lunches and stuff. I'm like, okay, mind you, in sixth grade, me and I did not have. We had what two classes together. No, we had like one class together. Now right. we're social studies. It's our last class. Last class. So, so when Yanni was doing her thing, she was doing her thing in the school. Like I didn't really know where she was. Didn't know what. Like I was doing my thing because I had my own classes. So you know, I'm. She's telling me this like after school. You know, we tell each other about right. our day. She's telling me this type of stuff. So, but our lockers was like my locker was right near each other. Hers was the yeah. lockers was near each other because our last other. class was near each other. Right. So you know, she had stopped walking me to my classes, bring me lunch, just doing a lot of extra junk. But me, I'm still not, I'm still not really paying it no attention. So, you know, on Snapchat in middle school, everybody used to use Snapchat. You know, post about your crush or whatever. So she had posted that she had like a crush or whatever. You know, me being her friend, like we good friends. I'm like, oh girl, who you talking, who you talking about? Mind like, you, me and Yanni always, we was popular on Snapchat. Because our school, our whole school used Snapchat. So we was kind of like the, not the, I wouldn't really say famous one, but popular one. Yeah. On, on not even famous because then we didn't have yeah. no This was before we didn't have on that. But before we was, our personalities was real loud in school. So we so got anyway, a lot of views on our Snapchat. So anyway, so, so with the Snapchat or whatever. And I'm like, okay, girl, who you talking about? Like, who you talking about? Like, you know, I want to know. So she get to explain to the person. She wants to tell me the name, but she get to explain to who it was. And she was like, oh, I know it was a girl. She was like, oh, um, she kind of short. My name is like small. Y'all think we small now? We had, we 4'11 now. We had to be like 4'8. No, so like, please. 4'7. No, we had to be, we was, we had so to be we was compared to everybody. And y'all think we skinny now? We used to be really skinny. Like, really skinny. But the but face always gave. The face always gave. Um, our hair is short now because we cut it and stuff like that. Don't stop. But our hair used to be so real long. Long, long, real long and long. curly. So the face and so, the hair they gave. So that's right. why we was popular. You know. So then she get described me talking about, oh, she got long brown hair. I'm like, okay. Mind you, she ended up, blah, blah, blah. Some time went past where I'm asking her about it or whatever. And she ended up telling it was me. You know, I didn't really say too much. So I'm like, okay, she liked me or whatever. I didn't like her like that. Mind you, I'm in sixth grade. I'm not really thinking about none of that, you know. Right. I'm not really studying none of that. So 
I didn't treat her no differently. I was just like, okay, she liked me. We still friends. I still see her as a friend. I get to um, school the next day. I think it was a Monday. That whole thing with the Snapchat happened on the weekend. So we get back to school and, you know, she's still helping me in my locker and stuff. Doing more stuff this time. Like making sure she there before the, I get out of class. All of this junk. So I'm telling Soleil. My bad, the pizza's not really giving. It's not. I told Soleil. And I'm like, okay, this girl likes me, whatever. She keep, she keep like walking me to my class, whatever. And I think the way I said it kind of gave Soleil the impression right, uh, that she was bothering me. So this was Soleil Park coming in. So she told me, and mind you, since I, everyone switched classes at the same time. First period, so everyone had switched classes at the same time. So when Yanni would go to her locker, I'm at my locker too, and they was close to each other. So I would see her getting the books or whatever and I'll see her I couldn't see all the in-between stuff but I could see her getting the books carrying her books and stuff like that so I'm thinking when she told me that she told me like the girl was bothering her like it wasn't it wasn't because y'all didn't really care yeah y'all didn't, didn't really care. care she didn't really mind I knew she but, girl, so I wasn't really like but but she told me like she was bothering her so my little bitty skinny skinny leprechaun self thought I was popping big junk I'm talking about some if you feel this way, then she needs to stop. She needs to stop carrying her books. She needs to stop. She needs to stop doing all of that. You feel uncomfortable. Yanni never spoke up. And I feel like she didn't speak up because it didn't really matter to yeah, her. It didn't I really, really matter. Didn't I think I just kind of took it to another level. Right. Slave is always over dramatic, so of course she's going to take it there. Right. So, you know, so they talked to her, but she was just like, okay, I, it still was going on. Mind you, the girl is talking. <laughs> Everyone is taller than us everybody. in school. Everybody. So everybody. I'm just like, can you, my sister don't like you. Like I'm like, and the girl is like, Good look down. Like, is you serious? Is you serious? So whatever. So the weekend, the next weekend come, right. and we all at our friend house. Right. And you know the slime days, whatever. We all making slime or whatever. So we had got bored. It was over our ex best friend house or whatever. Okay, we go to the store right, and you know when you get with a group of friends, you just think you right. just, just running it. You, you running know? it. You think you just running it. And I already thought I was running it by myself, so if I, I done got with me some group of friends, so now I, <laughs> of think, course I, think, I think I'm running it. So we go to the store or whatever, and I don't know how they got the text or how so I don't I really don't remember Something what happened. happened. I think they had seen me texting her and thought again that she was just bothering me. Right. My this time it's on messages, it's not on Snapchat, it's on right. messages. It's on messages or whatever. So they get into it in the middle of the slime I just going back and forth, going back and forth. And I can't remember exactly what was said, yeah. but it got to the point where it was like we was we like fighting. Oh, we fighting at this point. Right. Like, we're gonna fight. You bring your brothers. She's talking about she got her sisters and her cousins. You know, got brothers. So we like so we just gonna we just, we just gonna, gonna do what we gotta do. Mind you, we was in middle school. None of this is actually gonna happen. We just talked. Well, that's what we thought. That's what we thought. That's what we thought. Right. That's why this is this. I feel like y'all can get a lesson out of this. Don't just start talking thinking, oh, nothing gonna, nothing happen, gonna happen. Or happen. you just talking just to be talking. Cause some people not on that. Mind you, we not on that now. But in sixth right. grade, it wasn't no real, real right. problem. Real problem. That's what, that was gonna get to. That's the what we thought. That, that's what we thought. Keep that in mind. We Keep talking. talking. Keep we talking. talking big. Like this is after this weekend, we left this in Walmart. Like we left this here. It's not gonna get no bigger than this. So right. she said what she said to say. Boom, boom, boom. So that was that. Right. And then mind you, we get back to school, and this time, Trophy not talking to me. Like she distant. She real distant. You know me. I I kind of care because I mean that was my friend. Like that was the only friend I really had. I was really shy. But at the same time, I was like, okay, we done got into it. What else did right. I expect? Of course, she's not gonna keep talking to me. So, all this past, all this past, I had stopped seeing her. She had stopped texting me. This week, you know, some time had got passed. So a few days, I think it was, no, it was, it had to be like a week or two had went past. Where me and her not talking, everything right. just moved. So, we think everything just, right. And I could tell Yanni was kind of feeling bad. Right. And I kind of felt bad because I feel like we did too much. Like, this is Yanni. Yanni already shy, so she found her a friend. And we done ran a friend away. Right. Kind of stuff. So, so this okay. is where I get Mind you. Mind you, okay. It happened in lunch. This whole thing happened in the lunch, right? When I went to lunch, Soleil wasn't in the same class. Mind you, we had one class together. That was our last class. Me and Soleil went to the same lunch. We both had a lunch. Different classes, though. So, okay. The class I was in, I was with my friends in my class. Yanni, she used to sit 
she used to sit at the end of the table because me, me, I think we, I could read lips when I was in sixth grade because all my friends was at different tables. So I'm not sure I didn't have no friends in my thinking class. Thinking I had superpowers, reading people's lips. So I would, y'all be talking. I'm like, oh yeah, I can understand what you're saying. Okay. So I'm with my friends. I got two friends in my class. I, I'm not even going to count. I don't like any of my other classmates because they wasn't real. They didn't step up. They didn't say anything. They was just bystanders in this whole thing. So I never really messed with them after that. So I'm with my friends at the lunch table. Mind you, it's like parent conference, parent teacher day. So yeah. all, parent, the parent, all the parents in the all cafeteria. All the administrators, principal, assistant principal, all in the cafeteria. cafeteria. Who y'all think was watching the office? Who? Nobody. The doors was open. Cause every, door, PTA, right. every PTA day, but they just leave the door, door open. So you could just the parents come in and go in. to the cafeteria. Like you right. probably go to the cafeteria on your own. Our school was set up with the, the front. These are the doors from the front office. You When you walk in, you can go down and that's going to take you to the cafeteria. Or you can go like up the steps. It's like a little bit up the steps. You at the office. So the office could see the, the doors or whatever. Because when the doors wasn't open, you have to like press a thing and it'll beep you in. Bam. Wasn't nobody in the office. Nobody at all was in the office. Everybody was in the cafeteria. So we think it's a regular day. Okay, regular day. Okay, I remember. Now I'm talking about every parent was in the op in the cafeteria. Every parent was in the cafeteria. Every parent, every teacher, every administrator, everything. I think we had our school was weird. We had like three principals, assistant principal. Right. We had like three principals. I don't know why we had three. Principals. So we sit in there and we didn't have the same the tables that we were sitting at was across from each other. Like. It was my table, kind of by the door. A few tables in between. Then the table. My table was right when you, as soon as you walk into the cafeteria, my lunch table was right here. Right. My my lunch table was right there, and then the back you see the um the lunch line. Right. So mind you, I there's a window, a big window that you can see the front of the school. So I just remember, I don't know why this caught my eye. I feel like this was a sign, like these people are coming here for you. Right. So we just chill. I'm talking to my friends. I just see like okay it was I forgot what car it was but it was a lot of people that got out the car that's what caught my eye it was a whole out of this one car a whole bunch of people got out of this was one car, in car deep in the car a whole bunch of girls and some people stayed in the car so I'm like who family is that right like who? so me I'm just sitting there you know chilling doing me I keep looking at trophy and she trying not to make eye contact with me so i'm like okay like i'm not even thinking it. about it because you know we had stopped talking or whatever we wasn't really friends like that no more so i'm like okay but it was kind of weird right. so i'm just sitting there whatever and mind you all the teachers are around all the teachers all the principals everything even my teacher was in it we ate lunch together my teacher ate lunch with our class so i'm sitting next to the teacher and then this happened Y'all, why I got my, I'm not sitting this way so I can see the door. I'm sitting this way so I can see the lunch line. Our lunch line door, wall was clear so you could see who's going. That's the key point in it too. I'm sitting like this. All I, I, okay, five minutes have passed. I done seen these, all these people get out of this one car. So I'm like, who family is that? Like, I'm sitting talking to my friends like, who brought their whole family here? Right. You're not supposed to bring a parent. So who brought their whole family? Y'all talking about kids and all, babies and all. So yeah, five yeah. minutes Five minutes passed, they walked, everybody, all they, the people that got out the car walked to the cafeteria. I'm talking about, what, what's that word? Frantic. I think I'm saying that right. Frantic. I mean, just mad. Look, it's like mad. they looking, looking for, for somebody. somebody. Right. Mad. Then, Angry. we had seen the girl who worked at the gym. We like, why is she why up here? Why is she up here? Why is she up here? Mind you, we did not know that was, that's her older sister, but right. we did not know that. We ain't know that. So, right. we think, oh, why is she up, why here? Is like, she up here? She don't have no reason to be up here. Right. When we be at the gym talking to her, she ain't saying that she like she got no kids or whatever. So I see somebody, mind you, at this point, two of our principals in the lunch line. I could see them because the wall was clear. Glass, it's glass. It's glass. Some lady with some, I think this was her mom. I think this was her mom. Because her, I think her sister was the one that came up to me, but her mom was the one. Okay, some lady came in storming into, after all of them, storming into the cafeteria looking for, I guess, one of the administrators or whatever. Had a baby on her hip. Real ghetto, like, real ghetto. Yeah. It was real... Just, it was real, real hectic, hectic, real just real all over the place. All over the place. So I mean, I'm I'm sitting there looking at them like, why is they running around like this? Like Literally running the around with they with their heads cut off. Like, what is y'all looking for, or whatever? Right. So I turn back around, whatever, minding my business. I'm not really thinking they there for nothing. Why? So I'm sitting this way. So mind you, I'm looking at the lady with the baby. So I'm like, who? Whose family? I'm talking right. about the cousins and everything. Right. I'm like, whose family is this? 
Like really, who really whose family is this for real? Cause it's getting out of hand. Like y'all, they you should have seen the way they came in there. Like they was on a mission looking for somebody. So I'm right. like, who family is this? So I'm talking to my friends or whatever. All I all I heard or I heard somebody behind me, but I didn't turn around. Mind you, I don't not mess with my classmates for this. This was I had math. This was my math class that came to lunch with me. I did not mess with them. They so like. Fake, like, fake. Weird. You, you. I, if it was them, I would have been like, "Hey, um, you, you doing a little bit too much." It's my classmate. Um, I don't think you really supposed to be doing all of that, but you know, they really wasn't like that, so I get why. So I like hear somebody behind me, all the cousins and stuff behind me. So I'm like, I don't even want to. At this point, I'm, I'm this high. I'm not even on count. I was a little bit like not scared, but I'm like. I don't even want to turn around because what's right on behind me. It's already a lot going on in front of me. I don't want to turn around because it was behind me. So, somebody tapped me on the shoulder. I'm like, I look at she, she like, she like, head down, head, head down. down. I'm like, but mind, mind you, you, I don't know what's going on. Y'all don't know, mind you, I'm talking about the day we got to argue with her was like two weekends ago. So, right. I'm like, this can't be, this can't be, this like, can't, this can't be. be, right? So, I turn around. I mind you, I'm our our table was low, so she's up standing above me, like talking to me like this. Mind you, I'm short, so of course I'm, she's not gonna be out of eye. Right. I turn around. I don't know if it's her mama or her sister. It wasn't the sister we know from the boxing thing. Right. But she might. It she was somebody so else. It was somebody else. I don't know she who they so was, many. but they just had a lot of people. She had so many Forget cousins. The names. We don't even know the names. So. The lady talking to me, first of all, I, it's so loud in the cafeteria, it, but it's always been loud because it was loud because of the kids, but then their parents and all of them was there. So they right. talked to me, so it's just loud in the cafeteria. So I can't really hear what she's saying. All I know is she, she, uh, it's aggressive. It's aggressive. So I'm, I'm looking at her like, like, I'm, I'm really lost. Like, I'm seriously lost. So I'm looking at her like, yeah, something about, um, uh, something about she wanted them twins. Um, something looking for me basically. You one of them twins that was arguing with Trophy on the phone, so I'm like, that's not clicking. The weekend's not clicking to me because I'm shocked. I'm like, who is this? Right, so that's when I see it. So I turn around and I whole see the whole time Yanni doing this, she's still in my face arguing. I can't remember what she said, she's just in my face arguing. I turn around and all I see is about four or five grown people in her face, like this close to her face. It's like the main one talking yelling. to me, but then you got the cousins behind. So me, I'm like, oh, what's going on? Like, what is y'all over there in my, uh, what is y'all over there near my sister doing all of this? Right. So I tap with my teacher. I said, okay, who are they? Right. I said it straight. I said, we don't know them. Who are they? Why are they in my sister's face? Me. I'm not that I would bet then. I wasn't the type to, oh, let me just get up and go over there and, you know, see pop me? my jump too. If they went to Yanni, I probably would have got it. But I was shocked. So I ain't really care about that. So I'm like, okay, I don't really know that person. What are they doing? Like, what are they doing? She was this close. I said, that's not our mom. That's not our parent. Whatever. Huh? Their breath was hot. Really? Or whatever. So um, I see it. Like I said, uh, I said all these. I'm thinking to myself, I'm all these principals in here, all these administrators in here. And y'all don't see this. Y'all just acting blind like y'all see this. So a parent had walked past me. So I tapped her. I said, um, can you get like an administrator or something? Because we don't know them. I know it's PCA day, but we don't really know them. I don't know why they're screaming in my sister's face. We don't know those people. So she was like, oh, oh, what? Like, what? So how did I get? She was like, how did they get in here? I get a principal. I can so how y'all know. Girl. Just acting real dumb. Like, just go over there and get them. Like, so she had went over to the to the um administrator, or whatever. Mind you, by then they gone. You, um, you know, took too they long. did. They did a one two. They did a one two. It was a one two. Nah. It was the police wouldn't have caught them. Then then nobody see what they faces. They did a one two. Right. Like they went For in sure, they looking. Did a one, two. Yeah, they went. So mind you, the administrators were so trash too. I'm not even the the principals. They was trash too. I don't care at this point. I don't care because I'm just putting it on the table. The right. parents in there, they was trash. trash. The school trash. trash. Like I'm telling you, real trash. So so after that. We, our math teacher, me and Slay had the same math teachers, not the same class. So, we tell you our math teacher. The same math teacher? We had the same, Miss Madison? Yeah. We had the same math teacher. We did? Yes. What period did you have her? Fourth. I had third. Okay. Ah! <laughs> so, we told our, we told our math teacher, she was like, oh, well, y'all need to go to the office and tell them about right. that because you didn't know those people. Like, y'all sure y'all know? I said, no, let me didn't know those people. I'm pretty sure I would know my mom. My classmates was... 
they they snitch on everything else. I'm telling it's another teacher I can't tell. We can't tell you about that situation. They gonna snitch on everything else, but can't help somebody out when they when they somebody get yeah, 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 like, when it's time. Right. So I'm like, I really don't mess with y'all for that. I really don't. Like right. So we tell our teacher whatever. So we get to the principal office. You know, he had to write out a little statement, whatever. We were mind not so, you, so mind statements. you, at sixth grade, you wasn't supposed to have your phones or whatever. Right. But me and Slay had our phones in our backpacks and. At this point, my my table was still eating lunch with her. I said, oh, no, forget y'all. I'm walking with Soleil at this point. So right. at this point, I'm going back to her class to put the lunch so I can tell right. the teacher or whatever. Y'all. So I had got my phone, and I had called my mom. I don't know if I, don't remember if I called her. I texted her, basically, but basically had told her what happened. Like, right. these grown women came up here and was yelling in Soleil's face or whatever, talking about, right. oh, here my cousin, whatever. We outside right. if y'all ready or whatever. M my mom was up there at 2.3 seconds. She don't play. She done already been up there a billion and one times. She, she do not. And with like, the whole statement thing, I I could say I wrote that statement in like a minute, two minutes, because we we didn't wrote so many statements because we done been up there so many times. I'm telling so, y'all, I cannot exaggerate this enough. Like we was in the office our whole sixth grade year. Right. Because of the people not even the people we hung around with, because I'm not gonna blame it all on them. It was just we was just real right. chaotic. It was just sixth grade. Yeah. yeah. So we talking about that. My mom came up there and when she got there, oh she was going off on every everything broke loose. Like why y'all had the door open? Right. Why y'all even let something like this happen? How was a real right twelve. How is a random person even 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 get the chance to get in my daughter's face, just cursing everybody cursing out. Everybody. Because I, I could see if the me. principal and y'all wasn't in there, but y'all was in there when it happened. Right. Y'all just let it happen. And how did they even get down here? You were supposed to be checking them at the door. This right. is a school, a public school. They supposed school. to have a little badge. Like, everybody else got a PTA badge. Where they badge at? So, long story short, my mom, I think we found a restraining order against them or right, something. Or something. The air yeah. part don't really matter. Trophy, Turn, trophy we didn't see that. I think she actually moved schools yeah. after that because after that day we didn't see Trophy at, at all. all. At, at all. all. Next time we seen her, we was in seventh grade. At all. So I think she moved schools and everything. We know her now, like we. She know right. who we are now, like we know her now, right? But, or whatever. But y'all, the end part of my mom went off. Uh, she got on all the teachers and everything. She wrote bad reports about them. She was yeah. not. Going. She was not playing. She was not. She playing. was not playing. So and all of this happened because the girl liked me. All of this happened. It really happened because you didn't even speak up and really express really how care. you really felt. I really didn't care to be honest. But yeah, that's basically what happened. Right. Um, this really just a sign to like don't be, you know, tr know who you dealing with. Know who you dealing with. Know who you dealing with. And know and what you get yourself into. into. Right. And yeah, if you don't know somebody, you <laughs> get to working on them then. Right. Right. <laughs> Yeah. I'm just saying, y'all, but hope y'all like this video. Um, um, this is because we didn't even eat any of the food. You know, I'm right. It was very juicy, so we can But if y'all want any more story times from when we was in sixth grade, I'm talking about we got plenty. 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 Y'all, if y'all a real OG su like supporter, if y'all a real OG supporter, y'all know we done had lives talking about this. Lives. I don't think we lying. If y'all scroll back and get a fan page, whatever, and see, y'all gonna see the lives. Gonna see the lives. We need to tell yeah. that one story. We basically was held half captives at this girl's house. But it's that is the story. It's the day. That's for another story. story. But hope you guys like this video. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Um, get this video to 20k likes. And right. yeah, bye, Mommy Gang.